Welcome to the video. All right, so I hope this transition turned out pretty well on the camera yesterday. So trying it out today, so far I'm actually really liking it. The reason why I got this camera, this is the Canon M50, this is their mirrorless camera. Just using the kit lens with it. And the main reason why I got this camera is because I had the small Sony point and shoot I did not like the audio quality on it, and the battery life was awful. Autofocus is good on this camera, autofocus is good on the other one, but the main reason again was strictly for battery life and audio quality. Now, right now I actually don't even have the mic plugged in, so this is just the onboard mic. So probably not the best audio coming through right now, but I'm gonna go ahead and switch it to the mic. Okay, so now hopefully you guys can hear a difference. This has the external microphone on, hopefully it sounds a little bit better. So yeah, I mean, I got this camera, I'm really excited for it. It has this nice flip out screen here as well. So, so far, really liking it. I'm excited to make some like crazy good content for you guys and just get back to enjoying making videos uh, versus worrying so much about the technicalities, about the battery life and the color grade and all this nonsense. I just wanna be able to shoot the video make it the way I want it, upload it, and share it with you guys. So the best way for me to do that is whatever's the easiest thing. And I think that this camera is gonna be really good for me to use. So as you can tell, I just got back from vitamin shop, picked up a bang, getting the day going, it's about 11.30. I do want to get a workout in, today's gonna to be a chest day, and I'm gonna to have to get some groceries later, so do some meal prep and some groceries. And that's really what I got planned for the day. So I'm gonna take you guys along with me. Hope you guys enjoy the video. And yeah, that's it. That's it. What's up guys, I hope you enjoyed the workout. I just actually ran to the grocery store, got some food that I'm gonna be eating for the next couple weeks. Just wanna share with you guys what I got. So, just to start off, before I even made it home, popped open these cheddars right here, these are great. Snack, um, you can eat 18 of these for 140 calories, so Really good go-to. I like the cheddar and the car uh, caramel, caramel, however you want to say it, flavor. I got some Kodiak cakes. They now have these waffles. So these are really, really good. I like these in the morning. I typically have Ezekiel bread, but the grocery store that I went to did not carry Ezekiel bread. So went with these, changed it up a little bit. I got two pounds of ground bison. This is 90-10. The reason why I like bison is because it's just more natural. It's more regulated than beef is. No! And it just seems to have a little bit more flavor, so I like the bison. I also got five pounds of chicken thighs because these were on sale. 
Um, these are only like 99 cents a pound. I love so, steel on these, and the reason why I went with chicken thighs instead of chicken breasts, because a lot of you are probably wondering, why didn't you get chicken breasts? I hear chicken breasts are what you should be eating, or those are the healthy things, and yes, they're lower fat, but honestly, these taste a lot better because they're higher in fat and they're more satiating. So I'm gonna be able to eat them more often and not get bored and not feel like I'm starving and just eating a boring diet. Um, chicken breasts are good once in a while to change it up. If you're trying to, you know, lose weight, you're trying to keep your fats low, etc. But right now I'm trying to build my strength back up and just be consistent, feel good and have a lot of energy and having a higher fat diet is gonna allow me to do that. So that's why I went with the chicken thighs. We're gonna season those with some teriyaki Mrs. Dash marinade, no salt. So really good marinade to use on chicken, turkey, etc. I'm gonna season the ground bison with some jalapenos. I like to spice things up. As well as with some mushrooms. So these just help add more volume to my meals, helps add vitamin D and just a little different of a texture. So I like adding mushrooms. Another snack that I got here, some almonds. I like to snack on almonds throughout the day. This is the sriracha flavor. I really like the coconut ones, but I have not been able to find those here in Vegas yet. So if you live in Vegas and you know somewhere who sells the coconut almonds, let me know because I've tried Walmart, I've tried Albertsons, and I've tried Winco, and I cannot find the coconut. Also got some all natural peanut butter here. That's pretty self-explanatory. Strawberries, blueberries, I got bananas. And last but not least, I gotta have some Oreos, guys. Like, I'm sorry, but like, you gotta be able to live a little. You cannot just deprive yourself. Like, you have to have some fun in your diet. You have to be able to fit in Oreos and you gotta be able to fit in Pop-Tarts. I'm typically gonna have the Pop-Tarts pre-workout or post-workout. These will just be, something that I have when I'm craving them. And honestly, that's the best way to do it because by eating like this, as you can tell, like 80% of this food is what you would call clean. You know, we've got the Oreos in here, these, the waffles, you know, and, and the thighs. Like pretty much 80% of this is, like I said, what you call clean eating. And I'm allowing that flexibility in my diet so that I can stick to this for the long haul. If I just get, chicken breast, tilapia, asparagus, broccoli, brown rice. I'm gonna eat that for like three days and then I'm gonna find myself in the drive-through of wherever, Subway or Raisin Cane's or Chipotle, whatever. I'm gonna find myself eating out and I'm not gonna be eating the food that I bought. So I need to be able to enjoy what I eat and stick to it for the long haul and that is how you find success in your diet plan. So that is pretty much gonna wrap up this video, guys. If you need assistance with any dieting, any workout tips, anything at all, click the link down below. I've got the application to my coaching program. Fill that out, we'll get in touch, we'll talk and we'll discuss our goals together. Other than that guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, leave a thumbs up down below. Make sure you're subscribed and I'll see you in the next video.